Solve everyday math problems with English numbers 11 to 20. Hello, English learners. Today we're diving into the wonderful world of numbers, focusing specifically on numbers 11 to 20. We'll be using these numbers to solve simple everyday word problems. Remember, practice is key when learning a new language, so don't be shy to pause the video and solve the problems yourself. Let's quickly recap the English names for numbers 11 to 20. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. These might be a little tricky to remember, but with practice, you'll get them down in no time. Before we jump into solving word problems, let's brush up on our basic arithmetic terms. In English, the four main operations are addition, plus, this is when you add or put together two or more numbers. The result is called the sum. Subtraction, this is when you subtract or take away a number from another. The result is called the difference. Multiplication, x. This is when you multiply or times a number by another. The result is called the product. Division, divided by, this is when you divide a number by another. The result is called the quotient. Now, let's dive into some simple word problems. Remember, word problems are just scenarios or situations that require math to solve. Here are some examples. One. John has 15 apples. He eats three of them. How many apples does he have left? Here, we are subtracting three from 15. So, the answer would be 15 minus three equals 12. John has 12 apples left. Two, Lisa found 11 seashells on the beach in the morning and four more in the afternoon. How many seashells did she find in total? Here, we are adding 11 and 4. So, the answer would be 11 plus 4 equals 15. Lisa found 15 seashells in total. 3. A baker bakes 18 muffins and sells them in boxes of 6. How many boxes did he make? Here, we are dividing 18 by 6. So, the answer would be 18 divided by 6 equals 3. The baker made 3 boxes of muffins. Practice these problems, and try to come up with some of your own. It's a great way to apply your knowledge of numbers 11 to 20. Thank you for joining us today to explore numbers 11 to 20 and their uses in everyday situations. Remember, practice makes perfect. Keep practicing your numbers and basic arithmetic, and soon, you'll be solving word problems with ease. We hope you found this video helpful and enjoyable. Happy learning!